Hey everybody, it's Rob from Flailthroughs. This is Gundam Battle Operation 2, and this week in the August 27th update, we have got the Dryson, which is another double Zeta suit. It is a Dom with a big B-Max. Um, pretty sure I, I watched the little uh, preview on the uh, monitor up there, and I swear it uses the uh, Ifrit Doug Schneid downswing, which that could be terrifying. Um, also, we've got an update. There is now a new rank above Captain. And I'm not sure if they've added S uh, rating yet or not. I know they're going to, but that is a possibility that it will happen soon. So, yeah. Um, there's some other big news, and I'll get to that at the end of the video. But uh, right now, just going to check out what's new to the DP store. Which, hey, that's interesting. The gun cannon detector, the striker custom, and the DJ are now all there. There are also, oh, that's right, they, 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 you have to become, you have to reach the rank of major to uh, get any of these, but they, yes, if you get all the way up to major, you are going to get early access to certain mobile suits for significantly more than they would cost otherwise. 400,000 points for, uh, to get any of them, but they're all quite good, so yeah, um... If you can, if you can just grind your way up to uh, uh, the rank of major, you've got some good options. Sadly, those seem to be the only new things. So, for this update, nothing, nothing new that most people are going to be able to get out of the DP store. Uh, level three guard custom uh, daggers here, though. So, I just got the. I think I have the level three guard custom. So it may be that that's new to the store too, and it's just not showing up for me. Uh, but yeah. All very good, all very early, so we out there's stuff going on here. I forgot they were going to do that, but yeah, that is part of the big update. Let's see. Uh, we've got the GPO-2 Beam Bazooka back up here. We've got the level 1 Yuma Lightning Gelgug available, and we've got the uh, Pale Rider Ground Heavy Arms level 2. Really kind of tempted to spend for the level uh, 1 Yuma Gelgug just because... That'd be nice to have at 450. I love that rocket launcher. It's fun to use. I, I'd like to get it, but I'll think about it. Um, but yeah, GPO2 is still an excellent 550 machine. If you don't have it yet, it's worth considering. A uh, bunch of other good stuff up here, too. Recon Zaku, Camphor, uh, Jim Cannon 2, Pell Rider Cav, G-Line Light. Zaku Cannon Rabbit. I have the gold award on this account, so you may uh, see things that uh, you cannot get. Uh, Troll Rifle is up for 290 tickets, and that's a temptation, too. Uh, let's see, level 4 uh, auxiliary generator. A lot of level 4 parts up, and level 3. Uh, the Focusing Ring, level 3. Yeah, bunch of, bunch of nice stuff up here. And I'm gonna. I have tokens. I'm gonna do a ten spin for the Grayson here, cause why not? I want to give it. A, I want to give it a look, and if I get it, I want to give it a try. So let's see what we got. And yeah, so the event is. O the anniversary event is over. Hope you got your Gaza C. And level three Mark II Beam Saber. Won't say no to that. Be nicer if I had. Oh, level two Hombrby Beam Saber. So there's now a level two Hombrby. We just learned that. And fixed twin beam saber, ground type uh, type B I think uses that. Um, gym command level four. Uh, Hyakushiki beam saber level two. A gal, a gal with a Dryson. Very nice. And beam saber enhanced level five. A uh, large beam rifle level two. Mark II Beam Saber level 2, which I already had. Uh, 5 barrel mega particle cannon low output. And a Neo Zeon hat. So, yeah, not a bad 10 spin. I got the weekly mobile suit. That's always a nice thing. And I am shocked that it is a general. I was really expecting a raid with that, uh, with that B Max and that animation. But no, it's a general. That should be interesting. Uh, since we've got a minute here, let's uh, let's take a look at the uh, stats. And hey, that took me to platinum. That's that's good. All right, so and yeah, I actually reached platinum on my Japanese account, which yeah didn't spend any money to get there on this one because I I can't. I have no yens. 
So let's see, the Drayson was much higher uh, level than this, certainly. Forget what uh, cost it said it was, but... Okay, it, at level 1 it is 550. It can use its own variation of the giant bazooka, which has um, 8 rounds at 2150 each, range uh, 350 meter, cooldown time between shots 6.0. And yeah, there's a level 2 of it. Um, let's see, the lar the Long Beam Tomahawk. 2,400 points at uh, level 1. Uh, unwieldy with no rapid attack, but has high power. Gotcha. Uh, has tri-blades, which I'm not sure how those will work, but we'll find out. And a 3-barrel beam cannon at, uh, uh, in its arm. So, yeah, very interesting. Okay, um... Skills. It has a dodge roll. Has a level 2 leg buffer, which, uh, yeah, damage reduction, I believe. Um, Anti-blast stabilizer, so if you're close to a mobile suit when it explodes, you're okay. Balancers, which are kind of necessary for uh, using a melee weapon like that. Uh, force injector. Level 1 combo controller. Maneuver armor. Explosive reactive armor, so it's got resistance to splash damage. Uh, K... Enhanced Tackle Level 4, which practically doubles your tackle damage and gives you extra distance. And AMBAC, so it will be also more formidable in space. But it is uh, ground compatible, so it will have slightly better boost efficiency and things like that there. So, okay, so they the developers released their, uh, basically, blog for what's up coming up in September... And what we're getting in September, in case you haven't heard, is water. They are going to be adding water to that dried-out river in the ruined city. That's going to be an actual river now. Uh, they're going to uh, they're going to add water to the port base. There, there, there's going to be water in that central uh, pit. And so, yeah, I, I'm assuming we'll also get a third compatibility that will work better for things like. Uh, Zgox, Agais, things like that. The our, Your amphibious mobile suits will actually be able to be amphibious. So, yeah, a lot of good stuff coming up. That'll be good. And, yeah, so that is what is in the game now and what is coming soon. So that is going to do it for this week's Gun and Battle Operation 2 uh, update. We will be back soon with more. So till next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later!